Hey friends, it's Therese, and today's video is a little different today. I thought I'd do like a fun little read with me, slash where I've been since I've been gone for two weeks. <laughs> I figured you guys would like to know. <laughs> but before I get into everything, how are you doing? I know the holidays aren't always a fun time for a lot of people, so hopefully the calming music and having a friend talk to you a little bit while we read together might help alleviate the stress or whatever bad memories might come up during this time. I also want you to know that if this is a tough time for you, you're very brave and strong for getting through this and you've gotten through it before, so you will get through it again. Just lean on your friends and your chosen family or your actual family to give you that help. As for me, I moved into my first apartment. I have a roommate, which is one of my best friends. And then, of course, like I mentioned, my two cats. I've also been sick, hence me being gone for two weeks. Thankfully, it was not Miss Rona. I tested negative. At this point, my family and I are thinking it's a really bad case of the flu slash some stress and exhaustion that just did not mix well during that time. But I'm feeling better. Like I can still feel the sickness working out of my body since I'm still recovering, but I am feeling a lot better. So it's not contagious anymore. We're all good. And I'm getting stronger, thankfully. And my appetite's coming back and so is my energy levels. So it's a good time. But that's basically where I've been. It's just been sick and moving. I'm currently in the process of getting my room set up and getting the last bit of things that I have back at my parents' house into this apartment, hence the delay in videos. I'll probably have a video of me setting up my shelves and unpacking the last bits of my room soon. I just need to get like the furniture, like my desk and my shelf all set up. Thankfully though, I do enjoy unpacking. Now, tell me about the book that you've been reading in the comments or the book that you've recently read if you haven't had a chance to pick up a new one. Since I've been out of commission, I'm still reading Crescent City. It's surprisingly a really addicting read. Like once I got past like the dreaded 80 or so pages of the book, it picked up really quickly and I have a really hard time putting it down once I do start reading. Since I'm over halfway done, I'm hoping to finish it soon. My biggest issue with it as it stands is the world building. It's very overwhelming. Like she kind of literally just took a bunch of like different mythologies and just mushed them into one world. And anytime I feel like I get a grasp on it, she throws more into the mix and I just kind of sit there with a scratch. But so far, it's a really accessible high adult fantasy. But let me know about the books that you've been reading. I need some more recommendations, even though I have enough books on my TBR that I, have, I can't seem to bring down. But you know, it is what it is. But I've distracted you well enough. I will let you read for a bit, or at least we can read together. 